Welcome to the Explorers Lounge. How are you guys doing out there? Great. Fantastic. Well, we are the Caribbean Princess Orchestra. It is our honor to introduce you to uh, our special guest tonight. Now, that first song was no accident. That was a very appropriate song for our next guest that's going to come up and perform with us. Um, because he is an expert on the bugle. Not just the bugle, but uh, the history of the instrument and the history of taps and everything else. You have enjoyed his performances on the ship already. Have you heard Mr. Yari play? Yes. Yeah. That's fantastic. Well, he came onto the ship with a couple charts and uh, we rehearsed them earlier today and now we'd like to, to play them for you. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Yari Villanueva. How's everyone doing? Yeah. Great. You know, uh, I brought my bugle, and uh, everybody thinks, well, that's all he can play. He's like bugle calls. That's all he does is taps. Well, you know, um, I'm going to play a number. We're going to start off with a nice little piece called the Bugler's Lament. And um, how many people have seen that great movie, From Here to Eternity? Oh, that, oh yeah. So for, uh, you know, he'd be, um, he plays that bugle on, on that jazz piece. Well, you know, you really can't do that on a trumpet. Or I mean a bugle, but uh, this piece comes really close. It uses uh, a bugle calls throughout it, and it uh, has a really nice jazzy feel to it. And at times you'll think, now how's he doing that without any vowels? <laughs> so here we go. Great little piece called Bugler's Lament.
I got switch. Now the next numbers I'm going to play actually needs some vowels, <laughs> uh, just to show you uh, that I actually can play the, the you know uh, instrument that does have vowels. Our next piece of music uh, was written by the American composer uh, Morton Gould, and this is actually part of a symphony that he wrote, and it's a middle movement. It's a terrific little trumpet solo that uh, is um, featured in this particular movement, and it's. Um, I'm, Morton Gold, of course, uh, wrote great, great music that's very definitely American and also a little jazzy sounding. And this is a nice little feature called Pavan for trumpet and band. to um, be part of this wonderful cruise, um, I told the uh, person on the other line, uh, wait a minute, I'm gonna really have to think about this for a little while, I'll do it. <laughs> and, I mean, it just took me that long. And of course, they said, well, we, we want you to play taps uh, every evening. And I couldn't think of a better way of expressing, you know, um, what I do as a musician. I spent 23 years with the United States Air Force performing that special call 
to our departed comrades at Arlington National Cemetery. And every time that I perform it, you know, I always strive to do my utmost because it is important for those families of those veterans when we come, when they come to Arlington to lay their loved one to rest. We want to make sure that not only the music's perfect, but the honor guard with is spit and polish, and that it's the greatest way for uh, the military to say thank you for what they've done to their country, for their country. Um, our, my last piece is actually a piece that's based on taps. And I found this piece of music oh, many, many years ago on, a, on an album that was done by 101 Strings. And it's called Taps for the Fallen Brave. And after I heard it, I just fell in love with it and uh, decided to write up a little arrangement of it uh, for cornet and band. And I think you'll recognize the tune. And this is a great way of, uh, you know, playing the tune taps uh, as a great tribute to all those who uh, serve. Thanks a lot. Come up here and a big hand for this great band. I'm honored to work with you guys tonight.